and Capricorn. Long time, no year. What's up, Capricorn? I'm really, really hoping that we got some good messages for you. All right. So let's get into this reading, Capricorn. These messages may or may not resonate. Take with it and leave the rest. We're going to jump into some tarot and see what's going on with you. All right. Spirit guides, angels, and ancestors of my highest good. Allow me to give Capricorn the messages they need to hear right now at this time. It could be a good Capricorn that needs some messages. So I'm like, I ain't even going to do that, Cappy. I'm going to come through with the messages. Come through with the come through. What's up, Woody? What's the messages for Capricorn here? What is the messages here for Capricorn? Spirit guides, angels, and ancestors. Protect me as I give the messages here. Any and all negative energy being sent to me, to my collective, to my family, I return it and I bind it to them instantly. So it may be. I say. <laughs> What's the messages? The Ten of Cups. Period. So you could be, okay, the tower. All right, hold on now, hold on now, hold on now. The ten of cups, the tower, the five, the hermit. Oh. The three of pentacles. I'm uh, Okay, so straight up, this whole group is under investigation. Whoever's been working together here, something has to do with somebody's hidden helpers. And they have a whole family like of hidden helpers that's coming to blow some shit up with the tower here six of pentacles the her the high priestess somebody's trying to have this pay to have this high priestess to be put in a compromising situation or to have this person put out okay we have the page of swords the five of pentacles the high priestess the six of pentacles and the temperance Ten of Cups. The Nine of Cups. So somebody here coming. Um, I'm picking up. It. You could be dealing with a Scorpio, a Pisces that could be coming to you with an offer. This could be someone that you share children with, you share a home with. This could be someone that you're quite happy with or maybe you're going out on a date with this person or maybe you just purchased something. What's the Ten of Cups, Nine of Cups? So somebody wants to come and wine and dine you, okay, and then it's over. Or there, then there's something here that changes or there's an inevitable ending here or somebody's transforming or they're changing something. What's the death in the Knight of Cups? So I'm getting the kiss of death, literally. Okay. When I see the Knight of Cups in the death card, that's literally like the kiss of death. So somebody's kissing someone, but they're, or they're bringing some type of drink that's going to change their life or whatever this drink is, it's going to transform someone for, yeah, the kiss of death. It could be a Scorpio. What's the what's the Knight of Cups and the Death card? The Ace of Cups. So newfound feelings or love for a Scorpio, or you could be in love with the Scorpio. Ace of Cups is here, so you could be pouring out your feelings, your emotions, or maybe something has changed, or you're like, man, I'm really really in love with you, but maybe somebody here is like a little bit like cold and aloof, or they're like, yeah, oh, yeah, okay. What's the Ace of Cups? So this could be like new love. The Scorpio could be a new love. Okay, we have the hangman, but I feel like somebody's a little bit detached, Capricorn. Maybe you're detached, or you're like, hmm, I don't know. I've already released you, or um, this could be somebody you have children with. You maybe have you may have children with the Scorpio, or a Pisces. And you're like, nah, I already released you and, you know, we cool and all. Uh, but I'm already surrendered this. I've already been enlightened about who you are, how you are, and I'm good. So, yeah, I feel like you already made a decision. And this possibly has put somebody's panties in a bunch here. Because maybe you don't want to heal a situation with this person. you already gotten clarity. This could be about an Aquarius, a Sagittarius, or whoever this is. You don't want to heal a situation, even though there's love there. You're like, hmm, I would rather just get new love. Or one person is in love and the other person is detached. They're like, nah. All right, so what's the tower? What's the tower, though? Scorpio, Aries, energy. The tower is the four of cups. So somebody here is a bit, like, blown back because maybe you're not interested and you're just like, hmm, no, or... 
something here is getting exposed or somebody doesn't like this exposure or they don't like this tower here or they're like man i'm mad because the four of cups is like somebody here that's that already has like three cups somebody here is like literally not getting what they want they're like man i already got these three cups down here and you bring me in a fourth cup and i already turned down this one and i feel like somebody here is just spoiled or they're being a brat right now with the four of cups it's like somebody here is like, no, I don't want that. I don't want that. I don't want that. And then like, here, do you want this? And they're like, no, I don't want that. So somebody's being a spoiled ass brat. It's period. They're being spoiled. They're spoiled rotten. They don't want to settle for whatever this is that they're getting. But they're trying to manipulate their way through it. And I'm getting it's not working. An empress in reverse. What's the four of cups in the tower? Yeah, so somebody here is like pissed. Or they're not happy about a situation here that happened in the past with the six of cups. So a lot of cups here. Somebody could be in there feeling. So what's the six of cups here? What happened in the past? Somebody here is trying to bring an offer here. Yeah, the chariot. It could be a cancer or a Scorpio. Heavy cancer energy. And I feel like somebody's just like complacent. They're bored with an offer or somebody's just not able to move forward. There's a lot of aggression here with the chariot. This could be a car that stopped moving or stopped working. Um... Somebody's in, uh, unable to move forward, uh, Capricorn. Why? Why, the, why they're unable to move forward with the chariot in reverse? Yeah, because I feel like something here is changing. Damn, the fortune, the will. Of, somebody's not on a good. They're not on the good side of the wheel. They're going through bad karma. This is why they're not. They're, they have the inability to move forward. This could be unseen circumstances here that somebody did in the past. All right. This could be someone here that's bored from a past offer. They're like, man, here you come from the past again, wanting to reconcile with that same ass offer, that same ass cup, and I don't want it, bitch. Okay, so the chariot, the will of fortune. This could be a cancer going through bad karma, a Scorpio, a Sagittarius, a, everybody going through bad karma here. What's the will of fortune in a chariot in reverse? Yep, from lying or being a thief or being sneaky or trying to run off. So somebody ran off on you, Capricorn. Um, it could be an Aquarius, a Sagittarius, a, a, a Cancer, a Scorpio, or whoever these signs is that ran off on you. They gave you a hard time, Ten of Wands, the, the Queen of Pentacles here, especially in love. And now they coming back with the offer. So what's the offer? Also, they want to bribe you with the strength card, or they want you to keep your mouth shut, or they want to pay you, or Leo energy. These energies like want you to remain loyal to them after they try to snake you, sneak you, or, or do something malicious towards you. Behind. They want you to remain loyal. Remain loyal to me, Capricorn, when I try to snake you. Remain loyal to me when I try to run off on you, when I try to like strategize a plan uh, to either steal from you, take something from you. Remain loyal to me here. For some of you, this could be another Capricorn doing this. What's the hermit? The hermit is the emperor. It was the queen of cups. What's the hermit and the emperor? So this emperor could be like quiet or they could be doing shadow work or maybe you ghosted this emperor or an emperor ghosted you. Give me the hermit and the, the emperor. So yeah, they left or they left you behind or you walked away from this person or the emperor could be abandoning something. This manager, this boss, the CEO could be abandoning something. They could be leaving, quitting. Somebody also could be quitting a job or they could be leaving a job as well. The Page of Cups, the Page of Pentacles, damn, and the Eight of Wands, the Ten of Swords in reverse, the Five of Cups. What is this? Uh-uh. Huge backfire. The Eight of Wands, the Ten of Swords, the Five of Cups. No. So a loss? Somebody could have lost somebody? And this is why they left or they abandoned you or something like that. Somebody lost someone. It could be a loved one. It could be someone here, a younger, the page of pentacles and the page of cups. Somebody could have lost a child. And I feel like this could have been, a, listen, trigger warning. This could have been like a backfire. Somebody's confused. Like, how did I lose my child? It's a backfire. Somebody wanted somebody else. Yeah, the... the 
somebody wanted somebody else's family to take a hit. The Eight of Wands in reverse with the Ten of Swords and the Five of Cups. This is a loss going back towards someone. Capricorn. This is a loss. Somebody could be mourning. This is a backfire. The Eight of Wands in reverse talks all about backfires, miscommunication. It could be slowdowns or blockages here. So whatever somebody wanted for an energy, like if they wanted somebody to pass away or to die, then then some then somebody else's loved ones pass away. Now this if there's an energy here that's reflecting on something that they did, and they're never they're they're not pleased with themselves. I'm getting the emperor could be very shameful. They're like, no, I'm just gonna walk away and I'm gonna leave. Could be twins. What's the emperor? Eight of wands, eight of cups. Damn, my condolences. Eight of Cups and the Emperor. The Five of Pentacles. Not only did someone walk away, but they're broke. They're down and out. They could be homeless. They could be. They could need money right now. They could be going through a hard time, a hardship. Somebody is in some type of poverty from something that they did. Look at all these cars surrounded around this Emperor. This could be some this could be like a father figure, a boss, or a manager, something that they did. Like they have all of these bad cars surrounding the bottom line. They may be the one going through this karma. Look at this shit here. Listen, somebody is burning. They're stressed out here. Ooh, we Capricorn. I just Y'all know I'm an empath, so I feel stuff on a different level. And why is this emperor the five of pentacles? Why the emperor and the five of pentacles? Why? Because of a lie. The ace of swords in reverse. So somebody lied on the energy here. They caused a lot of chaos. They caused confusion. Or they were very dishonest. Give me the um, ace of swords in reverse. Who was the liar one? Yeah, the five of pentacles. Or somebody could be lying about their wealth. They could be lying about their hardship. Or them going through like a financial loss. Somebody also is lying about their health. They're making it seem like they're stable. They're over-exaggerating. They're lying about some type of loss as well. They could be making it seem like they're they're healthy or they're well, but they need to go and get like some type of advice from a doctor because the hermit could be somebody here that need like somebody could be like need psychiatric help as well. Somebody possibly needs to go and get their mental checked. Yeah, because I feel like this person causes confusion for no reason. Okay. So some, something here is going on with somebody's mental or why they lie a lot. Somebody has a problem with lying. This is why they're the five of pentacles or why they're going through like hardship or insecurities or poverty or why they're experiencing the five of pentacles is out here again. Okay. Somebody could be lying on their health. They could be making it seem like they're healthy and they're not. Somebody really needs to go to the doctor. What's the five? Why are they lying on the five of pentacles? Ten of Swords. Ten of Swords here. Ten of Wands. Somebody got something, man. They lying. Somebody's sick. Somebody's sick. Somebody's sick. And they lying. Ten of Swords, the Ten of Wands. Ten of Swords, the Ten of Wands, Capricorn. We got the Four of Swords, bruh. Somebody's sick, bro. Somebody fucked up by here. Four of swords, the five of pentacles, the ten of swords, the ten of wands. The ten of wands is usually like a health issue. Somebody not doing too good. But they show up as the emperor. But then we have another person here that's being exposed. They're clean. The tower and the ace of cups. Somebody here is being seen as clean. Or somebody doesn't have this, whatever this is. Scorpio Aries energy. The Queen of Wands, the Empress. There's a there's somebody here that don't have what this Emperor has. Somebody sick, sick, baby. And, and there's energies that this in oh hell nah, bruh. Hell nah, bruh. What's the Ten of Wands, the Ten of Swords? So there's a betrayal, or somebody here has been trying to betray. Now, this could even be somebody trying to be trying to betray someone, or they lied on someone and say that this person betrayed them to force someone to go and do something to someone or to give somebody a hard time. So this emperor could have lied and made up this whole lie, like, oh, you know that so and so betrayed me. You know, they did this to me, they did that to me. Also, that the 
wh whoever said person could get betrayed or they could experience some type of failure or defeat or somebody's trying to force someone to betray someone. What's the 10? 10, 10 is here. 10 of swords, 10 of wands. Hangman. Hey, sacrifice. Somebody sacrificed somebody or they've been trying to. The hangman hey, is here, the four swords, or they've been caught. Slandering someone's name. Look, damn, the eight of swords. Somebody may be going to jail as well. The fool, the eight of swords. What the fuck is this? This could have been someone that's trying to sacrifice someone, man. Or they like, man, I don't know, but they got caught. Four of swords, the ten of swords. That's dead all day. Dead body. Dead man walking. Somebody here. I don't know. Five of pentacles. Somebody literally dead walking. They literally dying while they're walking. So they, so the summer. <sighs> Insides. Is this about their health? Let me see. Clarify. Let me see. Before I get to talking shit. Clarify this emperor with the five of pentacles, five of pentacles, four of swords, ten of swords. Clarify this angel, sacrifice, sick, listen, dog. I'm trying to tell you. Sixteen, sixteen. Capricorn. Sick. And they lying too. We have angels, protection, intuition, ancestors, synchronization, guys watching over you, prayers being heard, manifestation on its way, awakenings and realizations that somebody has been trying to sacrifice you. This could be somebody that's trying to pan a sickness on you, Capricorn. This is an illness, a burden, a recovery, negative situation, checking your well-being, negative impact on health, road to recovery, excuses to not deal with a situation. Somebody's trying to sacrifice you. And I'm going to keep that. A devil. Who is this emperor? What's the sign? Four of Pentacles. It could be a Capricorn as well. This person, they keeping this shit to themselves about their health or what's going on with their health. They're not telling anybody. They're going to play mind games. This person's trying to get revenge on everybody because it's everybody's fault that they sick. Five of Swords, the justice. If you've been celibate, if you ain't been giving up that nah, nah, I wouldn't fuck nobody. I wouldn't answer my phone. There's a, there's a sick person really around here that's getting people sick intentionally. The Five of Swords and the justice. They trying to take karma into their own hands because they mad they got sick. Who they get sick from? Who they get sick from? Who did this man get sick from? A page. Who did they get sick from? Listen, doing some devilish shit. The devil, the chariot, the eight of wands. Whoever this is, they was doing some weird devilish shit. Some weird kinks or somebody got weird like kinks and shit going on. Like, man, fuck no, dog. Like, somebody got some weird ass kinks going on. Like, they they kinky. Like, they do like, they keep it to themselves about their, but they, what's the three of pentacles? I ain't got time for that. Let's make this quick, Cappy. Somebody probably needed this message today, and you're welcome. The Knight of Cups. So there's some offer coming in. Somebody wants to work with you. The Seven of Pentacles. It could be a Cancer, a Pisces, or a Taurus energy that wants to work with you. What's the Knight of Cups? So somebody may want to come and date you here. You have the Four of Cups, but I feel like you could be rejecting everybody or telling everybody, ah, ah, think about it, maybe. What's the Four of Cups and the Knight of Cups? Yeah, because the Knight of Wands, and they feel like... I feel like these energies feel some type of way or they could be frustrated because they feel like you know something about them with the high priestess. They feel like you know something about them, uh, Capricorn. So they're like, hmm. Somebody wants you to let your guard down and you not use your intuition. I think that's a fuck no. 
keep focusing on your work because that's where your wish fulfillment is at here with the nine of cups keep building your brand keep being focused okay yeah these energies nah man hell no nah. they have a bad reputation listen somebody could have been trying to ruin your reputation maybe you predicted that some of y'all could be high priestesses you could be readers you could be a uh, spiritualist okay you could have your intuition you know what i mean like you, you could be on point with your intuition as well these motherfuckers trying to get you sick yeah, over in their head, overthinking, overanalyzing their stress. Somebody here is not thinking. They're not stressed about these scarcity tactics. This is why they stop partying. Yeah, because they're spiritual haters. Look at these spiritual haters that's stalking. Stalking you. Look at this shit here. I feel like somebody did not have enough. They didn't have enough of lying. They didn't have enough of making shit up about someone. They did not have enough. Even though somebody ran away or they're like, man, I'm not even... Or somebody ran to go and try to get some evidence on someone or or whatever this is. Someone here did not have enough of lying or making up shit. And I don't know, Capricorn. What's the head enough in reverse? Yeah, they didn't have enough of dirt digging. Somebody's trying to find some information on someone because they light irritates their demons. Or somebody's like, nah, it's something on you. Or you have somebody because they're a groupie. A groupie is dirt digging or they trying to find information on someone for some reason. Why? What is the information that they're trying to find? Why somebody broke up? What is the information that they're trying to find? They think that somebody, okay, a competition or when they could, somebody thinks somebody's stupid. Like they don't know that they're competing with them or they want to fight with them or they're at war with them or whatever. They think somebody is stupid. Give me this emperor here. With the five of pentacles, yeah, I feel like you're uninterested in this emperor. And they mad. I feel like the emperor mad because you rejected them. You're like, nah, I don't want to fuck with you. What's the emperor? The jackpot in reverse. Somebody lost their jackpot. Rich, winning money, got rich, inheritance, unexpected money here. It's in reverse. So if somebody here is sick or they're going through it, they can't make no money because they're sick. They can't win any money because they're sick or they have an illness. They can't manifest anything because they're sick. And they're trying to hide it. An offer is coming. What's an offer? Mm, to kiss my ass. Or you could be like, well, this is the offer. You can kiss my ass. Period. You can take you in that offer and you can shove it up your ass. How about that? Somebody's waiting on you to make a decision. And I feel like you'll be like, no, you just take that offer and you can shove it up right up in your ass. No, for real. Yeah, because I feel like somebody's a liar. They could have made up a lie. They could have made up some shit about an offer and it wasn't true. No facts. What's the lie? That somebody here was hustling, making it rain, focused on the money, getting to it. So somebody made it seem like they were a hustler. Somebody made it seem like they had more than what they had and they actually broke as hell. This could be why the five of pentacles is out here. They could make it seem like, oh man, I got this, I got that, but they're really broke as fuck. And maybe you're seeing... <laughs> So somebody made it appear like they were a big baller. I'm a baller, shot caller, 20, what do you say? Something like that, yeah. I feel like you're not about to lose your mind. You're not about to lose your shit or have a mental breakdown. You're like, man, I don't care about you being lonely whatsoever. I don't care about you having like um love on a brain. You could dream and fantasize about me all you want. You can have this undying love about me all you want. We don't care. Yeah, your light irritates their demons. But what's new? And they're mad. Somebody's praying for better days. Capricorn, that was your reading. <laughs> Damn, like, comment, subscribe, turn your notification bell on so you will not miss any of my videos. Till next time, bye.